Here we go, people. This is what I've got for you. Right now, the skies look great outside. A couple of little clouds out there. Those clouds will be thickening up for your day tomorrow. Current temperature comes in. You're 84, 85 degrees, depending on where you are. Uh, let's move forward there, Giorgio, if you could. All right, partly sunny, 85. Let's get going right now. The almanac will show you your high temperature today was 87, five degrees above the average. The severe chance is for the entire area tomorrow. Now everyone shaded in yellow. Yesterday, it was mostly just north and west. Now everybody. The Storm Prediction Center is saying we've all got a chance, a 20 to 30 percent chance for severe weather, damaging winds, lightning, heavy rain, flash flooding, all a possibility for our day on Saturday. So let me start breaking this down for you. Currently outside, nothing more than a couple of light little showers on the Jersey Shore. That's it right now. High pressure has been our friend all day. What's off to our west? We have a warm front approaching, so that's got some really warm, moist air associated with it. So it's a warm front. You're going to be hot out there on Saturday and Sunday, but there's going to be a wet weather chance. Now, starting off Saturday morning, I think Saturday morning is the best part of the day. In fact, it's probably bright sunshine out around the east end of Long Island. Clouds are starting to fill in, but this is the best part of your day. That's 9 a.m. Now you get to 1 o'clock. Some of those strong downpours are starting to make their way into the areas north and west of New York City. That's 1 o'clock. By about 4, 4.30 in the afternoon, it's right over the metro areas. And look at that. You get that dark red, that magenta color. Really heavy rain is a possibility here and some strong winds as well. By 6.30. Interesting setup here. Now you look at the east end. You're dealing with it, you know, say from 6, 6.30 or so on. But look at this. The Jersey Shore, very little for you. This could be understated. You could see more. But overall, I think the Jersey Shore, of both, like, beach destinations, I think the Jersey Shore is probably the best that we would have to offer for tomorrow. Sunday, less rain. Still some clouds out there, but breaks in the clouds as well. So what do you expect? I want to break this down nice and simple for everybody. Everyone has a chance for severe weather tomorrow. We all do, okay? There will be more clouds out there as well. It's not as bright and sunny. Uh, the best bet to stay dry is going to be the further south you go, so southern Jersey. I think the Jersey Shore does better than the east end of Long Island as far as beach days goes. Sunday is a hot day as well. It's the better of the two days. It still has a rain chance, but it's the better of the two days. So if you're going to the beaches or the mountains, uh, again, Saturday in both spots looking rougher out there. Sunday's a little bit better. Maybe still more of an increased chance in the mountains on Sunday than the beaches. But both days, both spots have a bit of a rain chance. Saturday's clearly the, the, the rougher day. Looking across the board, all right, we're gonna have a high temperature of 90 on Sunday. We will be 87 Monday, 84 Tuesday. Sunday is really muggy out there. And speaking of air, of air quality and things like that, guys, I wanna show you some video right now of some sunsets in this country that have been said to be extra spectacular because you maybe have heard about the Sahara dust storm blowing into our country. It's made its way all the way across the Atlantic and there are lots of particles now dispersed in the air. That sunlight as, it's, as the sun is setting refracts off those little particles. And of course the particles are colored orange and red so it gives a, a real vibrant sunset. It is tough for people who suffer from any sort of respiratory problems and there's also been some talk about the symptoms that this poor air quality can produce mimic COVID. So people are starting to think, oh, is it, is it a COVID that, sort of thing I'm coming down with? Or if you suffer from that sort of thing, it could just be the air quality because this does have an effect on the air quality. But the sunsets are extra pretty this time of the year. All right, that's going to do it for me, guys. Let's go back to you. All right, Lonnie. Thanks very much.